let's talk yeah. about the comic we're going to review. It's right. called The Eight Ball. Yes. Specifically, Art School <laughs> Confidential, <laughs> right? So what are we looking at? What's it all about? Uh, it's a pretty scathing critique of what it means to be an art student. Well, I, I, was an, I was an art student, um, and I, really, I, I enjoyed it. I thought it was, it was very much uh, self-mocking, and it was... It, it's a really weird place to be in life because you're doing something that is completely subjective. Like, it doesn't matter what you do, someone may or may not like it. I mean, there is structure there and it's a very important part of my life. Like, I really enjoyed it, but the idea of when they break down the characters and the way that he, he writes it all out and he has someone saying something and then has a full, huge description of what that person is, why they're a, can I say D-bag? Yeah. All right. D-bag? So why they're a, a good person or a bad okay. person or whatever. And talking about like, uh, and you know, the woman that makes her own clothing and is neurotic, or or the rich guy who, I know girls you know, like you know, and and <laughs> one of my favorite parts of that whole story is, and uh, being a former art student, the idea of taking like you know a tampon and putting it in a teacup and calling it art um, is is wonderful. Like I I remember getting away with a project in art school by uh, not doing my work. And at the last minute, grabbing a garbage can lid and taking my magic marker or my, you know, my Sharpie and drawing a rough map of Earth on it and going, this is Earth, and Earth is a garbage can and like the whole, and getting a only decent art grade. School, you know, that's the only kind of place where you can pull that off. Well, it's in the, what, the eye of the beholder and all that kind of stuff, right? I disagree right? with you. It's, I don't it's think it's more than a, that. It's a lot more than that, but It's sorry. not so subjective. I mean, there's reasons why there's an A painting and a B painting, and that's part of what students are learning. Um, well, but the artist, I think, had a, a pretty traumatic time in art school. Oh, this story is only from an angry point of view. Yeah. Art school provided me with a lot of great years and, and a lot of good stuff. I went, I went to art school in Toronto, not, not here, but it, it, it was an amazing time in my life. And this person happens to be a really good artist. Mm -hmm. And it's taking a lot of pot shots. Not just at art. And if you read through all of 8-Ball, they take pot shots of Catholicism and industrialism and everything else. The person who's, who's doing this book is a satirist, you know, like they're, they're having fun with it. Let me ask you this, do you read comic books on a, on a regular basis or? No, I knew you would ask me that question. I thought maybe I'd say that I was comic curious. Okay. Whoa. I knew a couple Ooh. girls that were like that in college. <laughs> uh, now let me, let me just say, uh, I, I take this, as, he's not, sometimes you can mock something with affection. I don't think he's, well maybe a little bit of affection, but I think he really, does feel himself to be, if not outside of it, then, or if not above it, then outside of it, outside of these stereotypes. Because I didn't go to art school, but I know probably all those people that are in there. I've met them. I'm sure they're in every city, I'm sure they're in every school. What's the nice thing is that he draws some art students general, and then he draws some other students with like such amazing detail that you know that those are actually based on real life people that he went to school with. And he gives, some of them, he gives statistics, like these guys are now working in New Jersey as, right? I think if you were an art student in the 80s, it was a really tough economic time. There's a scene where there's a girl flipping burgers with her BFA degree on the wall behind. Um, yeah. You know, so it was, it was tough times. Uh, it still was, it still, uh, did, you, did you think it was funny at all? Because that was, that was the point. See, it was, it was, yeah, it was and funny. And it's really good that art school maybe rejected him because he's gone on to like a brilliant career. Is this something you would recommend to people? Uh, yeah. Let me ask you this though, and this has nothing to do with the comic book. You've taught art, obviously. You've had lots of students in the past. Have any of your students kind of gone on to any, or have they, you know what I mean, like taking uh, maybe what you've taught them and, and implemented it somewhere else into, yeah. why are you guys laughing at me? <laughs> you guys know something I don't know. Have you? <laughs> you. Listen, I've been an art student my whole life. I've had a lot of really great teachers, and, and a lot of what is done in this, in this book completely negates and gets out of the way of the, the benefits and the great things that happen in art school. And focuses on, not necessarily, the ne I don't know if it's negative, or if it's just sort of... It's pretty negative. Uh, well, okay, it's very negative. It's extremely negative. Do you think negative. it's harsh? Too harsh? No, I don't think it's... There's always going to be people who are going to abuse the system. There's a lot of flexibility in art school. Um, it's, it's designed that way to give people a lot of space. Um, he just sort of didn't find his, his niche there and went on to find a successful career elsewhere. And that's really what we're teaching students to do, is to get in touch with their inner weirdness and find their niche that will <laughs> carry them forward. 
So I think art school probably did serve him really well. He happened to go to Pratt in Brooklyn, which is a really fine school. So even though he's made a living of sort of spoofing his art school experience, I think he probably did take a lot from that. Oh, absolutely. On that note, let's go to break. Come yes. On. The Comic Book Syndicate will be right back.